Today we're at Northup Golf Club in North Wales. It's a par 72 parkland course. Our handicap is still 18. We're looking to break 90 today. Opening hole is a par 5. And the tee shot finds the fairway. Second shot is okay. This hole was playing uphill, slightly more than the yardage on the card. We have around a 75 yard approach for our fourth shot. It's hit slightly thin, we end up right at the back of the green with a 60 foot lag putt for a par. Comes up short, we have a 12 footer for a bogey. Good pace, but just misses left. We tap in for a double bogey on the opening hole. Second hole is a par 3, uphill slightly. And our tee shot finds the green. We have a 30 footer for a birdie. It's an uphill putt. It stops four foot short. We missed the par putt by a hair's breadth, a card of bogey on hole two. Hole three is a par four, dog leg to the right. And we lose our tee shot out to the right, but luckily just missed this fairway bunker. We have around a 95 yard approach to the green. And we're on in two, another green in regulation, and we have a 20 footer for a birdie. Just stopped short, it was on a great line. We tap in for the first par of the day. Hole four is a short par four, slightly uphill. And the tee shot finds the first cut to the right. We have around a 110 yard approach to the green. Just misses left to the fringe. We bump one on. Now a six foot par putt down the hill. Misses by a hair's breadth. Card and the bogey, roll four. Hole five is another short par four. Dog leg to the right. And we're blocked out after the tee shot. This was the first time I played this course. So there's definitely going to be some course management errors right there. So we have around a 55 yard approach to the green for a third shot. Run in three and have a 22 footer for a par. Reasonable pace from that distance, more like a lag putt, and card a bogey on hole five. Hole six is a par three, stroke index 18, easiest hole on the course. Our tee shot finds the green. We have around a 40 footer for a birdie up the hill. Stops five foot away. And we managed to hold the par putt, second of the day, happy days. Hole seven is a par four, stroke index two, hardest hole on the front nine. A tee shot finds the fairway. Second shot was hit slightly thin with the bottom groove, but ends up in the, just a short of the green, which is fine. Chip one on from around 30 yards and have a 15 footer for a par. Good 
straight line, but just didn't hit it. Let's tap in for bogey with no drama. Hole eight is a par five, down the hill. And we hit a great drive, 240 yards in the middle of the fairway. Second shot is okay, we find the first cut to the right and have a 70 yard approach to the green. Which is hit right on line. Very happy with this. We have a four footer for a birdie. And the putt goes in, middle of the hole. Fifth ever birdie on this channel. Playing well now. Hole 9 is another par 4, dog leg to the left, and our tee shot goes around 210 yards in the middle of the fairway. Approach to the green is not so good, we find a green side bunker. Scoop one out, and have around a 30 footer for a par. Good pace, but just misses left slightly. We tap in for bogey, move on. So the front nine score was 42, six over. Uh, four greens in regulation, which is a record for me, I think. One birdie, two pars, no triple bogeys. Very happy so far. Hole 10 is a short par four, dog leg left. We lose the tee shot to the left. Some wildlife there. We almost ended up in the water hazard left, so we were lucky, but we had no option other than to smash a 9-9 over these trees, hopefully get to the green, and we end up in another greenside bunker. We hit it out, ends up on the fringe. Bump one back to three foot away. card a bogey which could have been worse. Hole 11 is par 5, stroke index 1, hardest hole in the course. And we hit our worst drive of the day, leap right, totally blocked out. So we punch one back into play, but it ro rolls a bit far. We have some branches to contend with on the third shot and we smash one straight into a branch and it ricochets off to the right. So it's like Groundhog Day, just have to punch one back into play again for the full shot and we have around 135 yard approach to the green. Miss is right, we end up in the rough. And we hit a great shot, right on line, but she stops two foot short. And caught a double bogey, which could have been worse. Hole 12 is a par 4, dog leg right, with some distinctly overgrown trees in the fairway. We're completely blocked out for a second shot, but still go for it. So we couldn't get over the trees this time. Have around, have just punch a low 9 iron for around 90 yards, end up on the fringe. We bump one on, we hold another three footer, card a bogey, and move on. Hole 13 is a par 4 short one. And this time it has a tree guarding the fairway. So we hit one around 200 yards, managed to clear the tree, but we were blocked out by another tree. So I decided to take my medicine, not going for the green there. Have around a 40 yard pitch to the green. For a third shot. 
This one was not hit well at all. I expect it to be a lot closer than 52 foot. So that's what we're left with, it's for a par. It goes racing by up the hill. We have a 10 footer to save bogey. Flips out. And we got a double bogey on hole 13. Hole 14 is a par 3, around 170 yards. And we missed the green on the good side. To the right. We chip one on. And left with a 20 footer for a par. Reasonable pace and effort. Card of bogey on hole 14. Hole 15 is the last of the par fives. We hit a great drive around 225 yards in the fairway. Second shot is good too. Flush that one and have around an 80 yard approach to the green. So we're on in regulation, another birdie opportunity, it's an 18 footer, right to left downhill slider. So good line but just didn't hit it, no worries, another par goes on the scorecard. Hole 16 is a par 4, and course management error, I was aiming to the right not actually to the actual fairway. So no option other than to split this 175 yards with two irons. One in three, we have an 18 footer for a par. Misses short right. Card a bogey, which could have been worse. Hole 17 is a par 3. Stricken deck 17, easiest hole on the back nine. So we miss right in the green side bunker. Splash one out right through the back of the green. So we hit another great chip back on, almost goes in, tap in for the bogey on hole 17. Hole 18 is a par 4, dog leg left, and our tee shot ends up in the first cut to the right. So a long way back, this is just a layup. It's hit to the left and we're blocked out. Just can only hit a punch shot here under the branches. So the connection was a bit too good on this one. Ran right through the back of the green. Have to chip one back with a four shot. Not such a good chip this time. And we're left with a 15 footer for a bogey. Good pace, but just misses left. And we tap him for a double bogey on hole 18. For a round of 89, so we've broken 90 by the skin of our teeth. We had four par or better scores on this round. Very happy with that. No blow up holes, no triple bogeys or worse, so i am played well in general. The front nine was great, six over, and the back nine was just hanging on. Uh, with some course management errors, which was understandable considering it's the first time I played the course, which I thought was a great course, uh, great condition greens, enjoyed the round in general. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, I enjoyed playing and making it, and see you on the next one, signing off.